as Israel cried out to Moses, cried out in distress, Moses took the cry to the only help he knew. For when my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock. I look to the hills. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. So Moses goes to his rock. The rock followed them through the wilderness. And he cries out to him. And the rock answered. In Exodus 14 and verse 15, the rock says to Moses, Why do you cry out to me? Tell the people to move forward. God says, I've heard enough of the crying. I've heard enough of the complaining. I've heard enough of the pity party. He says, no amount of crying is going to change your situation. No amount of complaining is going to give you the experience you desire. No amount of murmuring will bring about victory. You can choose to stand here and talk as long as you want. You can choose to cry as much as you want. Cry until there are no tears left to cry. Cry to everyone who will listen. Tell everyone about the sad state of affairs that you found yourself in. Blame all and sundry for your reality. In the end, that's not going to fix it. God says, if you want it fixed, you've got to move. If you want it fixed, you need to change. If you want it fixed, you've got to go forward. Not back, not where you're coming from. Not back to the experiences you've had. Now is not the time to focus on the past hurts and pains and failures and disappointments and betrayals. It's time to go forward. God does not want you to stand still and watch. He wants you to move forward. Yes, into that uncertain future. It's frightening. Yes, it can be very concerning. Because what does the future hold? You may not know what the future holds. But you do know who holds the future. And he who holds the future is holding your hand. He's promised to take care of you. So go forward. He will not allow you to be cast down. He will keep you. He will guide you. No wonder Paul said, forgetting the things that are behind, I press forward. Forward towards that mark. Forward towards that prize. Forward towards that higher calling. Your greatness is ahead of you. Your blessings are ahead of you. 
your change is ahead of you. If you don't like where you're at, if you don't like where you're coming from, then quit stalling and start going forward. For better is on before. God bless you. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And for more, join us at 9 a.m. at 10 Union Square, Crossroads, Kingston, Jamaica. If you can't be there in person, join us virtually via YouTube Live.